lied, I lied. There was not a second round reaction last night. Unfortunately. Um, been going through some stuff, so, you know. We've been just ch ch ch, -ch chilling So. Basically, what I'm going to do now instead. Um. We're just gonna go over the Sweet 16 matchups and everything. Um, yeah. I don't even. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Okay. So obviously the Sweet 16 begins tomorrow, which I did not realize. But it's been it's been a it's been a it's been a weird one, you know. After the whole UMBC debacle and everything, you know, and they get bounced by K State, so they're done. Kentucky moves on. Loyola Chicago beats Tennessee on another buzzer beater again in Nevada. They had a 32 to 8 run. They're going on. They beat us in overtime. Remember that. Another number one seed in Xavier. They fell to Florida State. And Gonzaga took care of business against Ohio State. So, and Michigan, they won on a last second buzzer beater as well. And AM. God, I hate AM. It just. Kick the dog shit out of North Carolina. They move on. I'm gonna go to the other side, and Syracuse just keeps on doing what they do. They beat Michigan State. Duke is gonna Duke easily cruised against Rhode Island, so you know they're moving on. Kansas struggle win. They struggled against Seton Hall. Um, Clemson beat the mess. Out of Auburn, um, Purdue had the scrape by against Butler, and West Virginia just destroyed Marshall, and Villanova just beat the brakes off of Alabama. So the matchups here in the Sweet 16 are Villanova taking on West Virginia, Texas Tech taking on Purdue, Kansas. Taking on Clemson, Syracuse, the last team in the field, baby. The last team in with one of the worst resumes I've ever seen in my entire life. They're going to take on the Doogies. Then on the other side of the bracket, you got Michigan taking on Texas A&M. I think I said earlier that Michigan was like a sleeper team. You know, people have been sleeping on them and... Um, I don't know why people weren't picking them to win, win it all. They, they, they had a good team. I've been watching them throughout the year. They're obviously, they're obviously not the the best team in the world. Um, the best team in the nation got blown out by a 16 seed. Oh, that's just that's that's still that's still just echoing in my ear. You know, a week after it's been over. Florida State takes on Gonzaga. And then an intriguing matchup here. We got Loyola Chicago and Nevada. So could Loyola Chicago pull it off and, you know, get all the way to the Elite Eight? That could be possible. It's been weird this year in college basketball with all with all this upsets and FBI investigations and whatnot. But it's 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 a uh, it's something. It's really something, I'll tell you what. And then K-State is going to take on Kentucky to wrap things up. Now, let's just pray that Kansas State gets the job done. Um, Clemson gets the job done. And Syracuse gets the job done. Even though nobody expects Syracuse to do anything. Let's hope they get the job done. And beat Duke, Kentucky, and Kansas, because I hate all three of those teams. They're all 
those big name schools that everybody likes to talk about and I hope that we don't get to see them in the final four because that would be devastating to look at or, or an elite eight matchup depending on what Kansas and Duke does depending on what they do don't I don't want to see that matchup yet no, I don't want to see Kansas or or Duke or Kentucky in the final four in a natty I mean honestly honestly if we were really talking here um, honestly I just have you know I don't even I still don't even know nobody knows anymore it's it's a it's a crazy thing this basketball season and we got some time you know we got this weekend for the Sweet 16 and the Elite 8 then it's on to the Final Four on to the Natty so much time is left so many storylines that need to be resolved it, it's just another one of those seasons I tell you what in college basketball and it's just gonna keep on going well, the Sweet 16 starts tomorrow think I'll be watching I'm sure at this time but let's see how this goes let's see who is gonna move on and who's gonna be sent home crying like the little girls that they are I'm still hoping it's Kentucky Kansas and and, and um at Duke though because North Carolina already got sent packing UCLA got sent packing and Indiana's not even in the tournament. Oh yeah, and Louisville got sent packing. And Connecticut's not even in the tournament, so you know. Nor is Georgetown. Nor is no. Oh well the Big East doesn't get enough love anyway. I'm out. Big boy variety is anyway. Uh we'll see ya. Um I don't know when. Maybe after the Elite Eight ends and we move on to the Final Four. Or it could be just another B log or something like that. I don't know. Alright, I'm out.